Our next student, who has a large family to take care of, and yet has managed to carry a 3.7 GPA. Heck, I couldn't do that so long in college. So. <laughs> uh, please allow me to introduce Ann Sinclair. I'm a nursing student at SEC. Um, I consider myself a pretty typical, non-traditional student. I'm not 18. Uh, I have a family, I have kids, I have a husband, um, I work, I, so I have a lot of responsibility outside of school. Um, I applied for a scholarship this spring and um, it was this summer that I found out that I was awarded a scholarship through the Spokane Valley Firefighters. And um, when I heard the news that I had gotten the scholarship, you know, I just felt so grateful. Um, I've been a stay-at-home mom for over 12 years. Uh, I've been very active in um, that life and, you know, just being with kids and volunteering in the community and uh, those things are very important to me. And in I think it was spring of 2009, I went back to school just very slowly and started my prereqs for nursing. And um, it was always a goal of mine to uh, be able to fund my prerequisites without taking loans. So I was happy that that was something I was able to do. And um, so that was great. About halfway through my um, prerequisites, my husband was laid off due to the recession at the time, and um, I, it was at that time in my life that I really saw some divine timing working in my life, because here I, you know, school is such a positive future thinking endeavor to undertake, and I, you know, you can't help but be optimistic when you're in college, um, thinking about your future, and so I had this very positive uh, direction to kind of guide me during a time of real financial uncertainty in my life. So uh, it was just very thankful for that. And then, you know, so now my husband is in his final year of graduate school at Eastern. Um, so we are both full-time students. We have four children. So our life is really challenging at times. Um, but uh, it's one of the reasons why being awarded a scholarship is such a blessing to me. Another thing that I felt was I just felt honored to receive a scholarship from the firefighters. And, um, you know, I kind of look at a scholarship as an investment. Um, it's an investment in somebody. And, you know, everybody wants to make a good investment. And it was just nice to know that somebody besides my friends and family thought that I was a good investment. So uh, that was just real dear to me. And I, I also know that this particular scholarship, um, they fund the scholarship through voluntary um, deductions from their payroll. So just to be honored with that trust was, you know, it really just means a lot to me. So I just want to say thank you, especially to the Spokane Valley firefighters and um, really to all the donors that give to scholarships. It really does make a difference. Thank you.